Hey guys, so what's going on? Welcome to my channel. Um, my name is Rio, otherwise known as the God Ra, aka Razul, aka Rasulito, Azulito, whatever you want to call me. Point is, it's different variations of blue, right? I've been playing fighting games pretty much all my life, and um, Pokémon is a pretty pivotal one in my life, uh, as I've recently found out. In regards to me connecting with people in that community in a way that I never thought I would be able to. As you go through life, you go through different tr transitions and phases, and you don't understand the gravity of the uh, and the depth of how much you might connect with people, right? I'm a pretty outgoing soul. I'm extroverted, and um, you know, I like meeting people. So, with that being said, I'm also very competitive. Back in 2016, uh, upon the inception of Pokémon Tournament, uh, I went to the arcade in Dave and Buster's. I was one of the few people that was going there, kind of religiously. I went there quite a few times before it was released on Wii U. So I had a lot of practice and I met some great players there. Following that, I went to a tournament that took place, I think on the 25th anniversary or something for Pokemon, I forgot exactly when it was, um, at GameStop uh, by Union Square. And I actually came in third. Uh, I tied for third, actually, I think it was. But it was a really fun experience. Um, in the arcades, I met my boy, Ray Del Empire, who's my boy, Jeff. The point I want to make in this video is, you know, we're all kids at heart, right? And we should all be cherishing every moment to the fullest. So when you do something you love so very much, especially when there's no funds involved, just straight for the passion, just understand and realize that what you're doing is creating waves in a community that you're a part of to more people than you might even know. I humbly show you guys this video. This is gonna be one of my first videos I'm gonna put on my channel where I'm actually gonna try and speak and I'm gonna be consistent with this. If you guys like this content, let me know. I'm gonna share the links below. I'm working in progress with you guys, so appreciate all the love. Enjoy. Razul! Who brought up Razul? We gotta talk about Razul. One of the best, the best original Gengar players. Razul is the guy who taught Mad luck how to play, right? So yeah, not a not a Japanese Gengar, but an American Gengar player from um, Raz is from the Bronx. Okay, I had a feeling Razul. Okay, there's people like Razul who were really early, really really early poking. Razul is one of the players who taught Mad luck how to play Gengar before we could even like talk to the Japanese community. So Razul was this like sick Gengar player from the Bronx who Mad luck would. Uh, would talk about combos with early on and really taught a lot of like the Gengar's combo game to Mad Luck. I think they explored Edge Tonish together. Maybe we saw Edge Tonish in Japanese tournaments, right? But it was like perfecting that and figuring out what that looks like in a, in, like, a practical way. Like the philosophy of American Gengar. Ray's gonna see if he's gonna call Razul. That's sick. You should let him know that people are talking about him in a Pokemon stream. It's Razul's birthday. Oh my gosh, Razul. Happy birthday. Wait, is Razul in this chat? Oh my gosh, it's real, real flows. That's Razul. Dude, happy birthday, man. Thank you so much for stopping by the stream. We were just talking about you um, and uh, sort of your history with the game. Razul, thank you. 30th sub? You're, thank you. You did not have to do that, man. Thank you so much. Razul saying, remember your old gods and goddesses. Yeah, have a great one, Rizul. I appreciate it so much. That sub was so sick. Um, just amazing, and I hope you have a great one, and happy birthday. It's just awesome. 